information about genes. Allah says, and he created the jinn and mankind only to worship. The jinn see us, but we do not see them because Allah has made a member in the eyes of man so that we do not see them because if we see them we might die of fear or become blind because of the shock. Their sight is really terrifying. They always live around us and there are three types of them. Number one, Ilfrit. This one have the ability to transfer things from one country to another and they are used by witches and sorcerers. Number two is al -Kabal. These are the freaks of the jinn and they disturb men such as wearing their claws, epilepsy and so on. Number three is Galan. They appear in form of man, cat, dog, donkey or any animal. Generally, all of them are weak and they flee when they hear Surah Yasin, Mawazatan, or Surah Bakara. Therefore, I advise you, dear Muslim brother or sister, when you change your clothes, say Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim so that they don't see your nakedness. When you sleep, sleep on your right side and read the Mawazatan because the jinn will sleep over you and suffocate you and also make you have nightmares just to bother you. Beware of planting pins or nails in the puppets or dolls for they live there. If you disturb them, they will prevent on you. Do not speak loudly in the middle of the night because you can upset them and they deliberately hurt you in silence. Do not cry alone because your jinn becomes sad on your sadness. They wait to hug you so your body temperature goes high. You should Mention Allah when throwing something and jumping from a high place because there might be a jinn sleeping and you disturb them and they revenge on you. Don't pour hot water in the toilet unless you say the dua for entering the toilet Allahumma inni a'udhu bika min al-khubthi wal khubai because toilets are their favorite place to live. If you feel your ear whistling without a cause of illness and you can smell fire now that a jinn is standing in front of you. If you see an animal and you got scared or you try to scare it but doesn't respond, now that it's a jinn. Don't stand undressed in front of a mirror or look at yourself since a jinn can fall in love with you and will try to mangle with you and end up hurting anyone who approaches you. And last one is don't be scared. Always remember Allah, Allah for the melt when Allah is mentioned just like metal that melts in the fire. Mu'awazatan means Suri, Surah Nas and Surah Falak. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching my video.